Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today we're gonna take a look at the Red Magic 8 Pro. Now you can pick this one up online, I'll throw the link up in the description. The price on this one starts at 850 bucks. All right, so let's go through the specs real quick. Now this one comes in two different colors. You got matte and void. Now matte is the black version, void is the transparent version. For the display, you got a 6.8 inch AMOLED panel with a resolution of 1116 by 2480. Now that's 400 for the PPI patrol. You got glass on the front, glass on the back with the aircraft grade aluminum frame. You got up to 1300 nits brightness and a 120 hertz refresh rate with 960 hertz touch sampling. For the processor, you got the Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Generation 2 with the Adreno 740 GPU. Now what does that mean in English? Flagship specs, bro, flagship specs. Now you got 12 or 16 gigs of RAM, that's LP DDR5X, 256 or 512 gigs of storage, no micro SD card slot for expandable memory. Now it's running Android 13 with Red Magic OS 6 skin on top. Now you got the ICE 11 cooling system with the vapor chamber cooling plate, and you got a built-in RGB turbo cooling fan. Now you got 520 hertz dual shoulder triggers, you got a 6,000 milliamp battery that features 65 watt fast charge. And that means you could charge this phone from zero to 100% in under 43 minutes. For the cameras on the rear, you got a triple setup. So you got a 50 megapixel wide angle, eight megapixel ultra wide, and a two megapixel macro. And you can shoot video at 8K 30 frames per second and 4K at 60 frames per second. Now in the front, you got a 16 megapixel under the display camera. I repeat, under the display and you can shoot video at 1080p, 60 frames per second. Now you got Bluetooth 5.3, NFC, Wi-Fi, always on display, face unlock, on-screen fingerprint sensor, RGB lights on the back, and a headphone jack. All right, so all of that for uh, 850 bucks, what's missing? No quad HD display, no IP rating, so the phone is not water resistant, no wireless charge, and no expandable memory. All right, so let's unbox it and see what it is. First things first, shout out to White Shoes, back in the building. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. White shoes, calm down. Okay, Red Magic 8 Pro. Now, on a side note, I've been using this phone for about a week. Let me say this. This is a true upgrade from the 7S Pro just from the build quality alone, and I'm gonna show you right now. Now, as far as the presentation, real nice, okay, gray box, gaming theme, okay, Red Magic logo. Inside, the gaming theme continues. Okay, look at this. Now you got the motorcycle, all right? <laughs> About to do a buck on the Van Wick. Look at the guy, look like a Halo guy right here. Okay, ready for action, Red Magic logo, okay? anime chick doing doing burnouts on a motorcycle. I like that. This is the kind of stuff I like with my presentation. Now inside, there's your SIM ejection tool. Of course, you got your usual books and shit, plug them and file them. And you do get a case. Now let's see the case. Just a little shell right here. Okay, but it's gonna protect the back of your phone. Now, we'll save the device for last. Check this out. Got a little insert right here. Make sure you scan these. The plug, okay, Samsung, Google, Apple, shoes, the plug, in the box where it belongs. And you got a USB Type-C to USB Type-C charging cable. Now, for the actual device, check this out. This is the best looking Red Magic phone that I've seen yet. Look at the build on this one. Completely square, I right, shoes, completely square. Matter of fact, let me peel this plastic off the back so you can get the full effect. Okay. Bung. Look at this. Now, put it right next to the 7S Pro. You see the difference in the design quality immediately. I think all phones, especially big phones, should be built like this. A big square. Makes it very easy to hold. Okay. And of course, y'all know I gotta say it, feels so good in the hands, ladies, you know the procedures. Now this is the big boy version, the void, okay, the transparent. There's your RGB lights in the back, we're gonna take a look at those in a minute. RGB turbo cooling fan, okay, triple camera setup, LED flash. Now I love how the transparent back looks. 
can kind of see the innards. I like that. Red Magic logo. Okay. There's your game space switch. Okay. Shoulder triggers. That's your power button. Let's kind of power this up. Okay, on the top, there's your mic. Headphone jack. Still alive. Headphone jack. On the bottom, other speaker grill, USB Type-C charging slot. There's your SIM tray. And on this side, there's volume up and down. Okay, so power button on one side, volume up and down, and your game space switch. So one more wipe down. Boom, there it is. All right, so let me pause the video, delete my browsing history, and then we'll walk through the OS. Talk amongst yourselves. All right, y'all, so we back in. First, let's talk about the build quality and the look of this phone. I literally love it. This might be my favorite built phone out right now. I love this completely square design. It makes it a pleasure to hold this big phone and the look of it, beautiful. This is the best looking gaming phone that I've seen yet. Simplistic, but it still has the RGB lights to give you that gaming effect. Okay, now as we said, headphone jack, power button, game space switch, shoulder triggers, there's one of your cooling vents, another cooling vent, volume up and down, okay, SIM tray, USB Type-C, speaker grills. Now, if you notice, you do have always on display, fully customizable. Now, this phone is not water resistant, but it can't be because of these vents. Okay, so no, no, no water resistance and no wireless charge, two things that you're not really gonna find on any gaming phone. Now, a couple of different ways you can open up the device. You got your on-screen fingerprint sensor. Let me make sure I didn't put my password in too many times. All right, let's try it again. On-screen fingerprint sensor. Works flawlessly. The problem with me is I keep getting this little uh, skin tag on my thumb. So if y'all see the fingerprint acting funny, it's not the fingerprint sensor from the phone, it's actually my thumb. But I did try to set it up around that area. Let's see if I if I remember how I did that. Right, let's try that again. Yeah, I set it up on the top of my thumb and it works flawlessly. Even sometimes through my, <laughs> my skin tag. Now if you want, you can swipe up, put in your pattern and your pin, and you do have face unlock. You see a little face symbol? Bang, there it is. So excellent biometrics. Bang. Let's try that fingerprint sensor again. Bang, there it is. <laughs> I like to make sure everything works flawlessly. Bang, there it is. Now, if you swipe over once, this is the global version, so you're gonna get your Google homepage. I love that. 120 hertz refresh rate, buttery smooth. Okay, now let's go through some of the basics. Swipe down, there's all your notifications. Let's go ahead and clear those. Bang, just like that. Now you got all your quick toggles. Okay, so of course you got your flashlight, you got your mobile hotspots, your cooling fan. Oh, hold up. Did y'all hear that sound? Now I'm gonna be honest with y'all. This is my first time hearing that sound. I never hit the fan from the toggle right there. Bro. Do you see the RGB lights on the back? Hold up. I don't know if y'all can see that. All of that is RGB lights. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll dim the lights in a minute so you get a better view. That's your turbo cooling fan. Of course, you got screen record, screencast. You got your free window. That's your floating windows. Oh, I like that sound. <laughs> okay, LED light strip. Okay, now let's see if I if, let's see if I could. Matter of fact, I'll dim the lights when we get to that part, and you'll get a better look. Of course, if you hit more. Okay, so you got your focus mode, live caption. You got your sound amplifier, storage, live translate, auto Shazam, and your QR scanner. Let's take it over to settings. All right, I'll try to make this part quick. You got VPNs, okay, NFC, and your private DNS, uh, nearby share, and Android Auto. Okay, let's go to personalized settings. Now you got a bunch of different themes to choose from. Look at all these different always on displays to choose from. Now I, I tend to go with the classic ones. Okay, you got art, customization. I like the uh, analog clocks the best. So I usually go with that one. And you got your digital clocks. All right, so a bunch of always on displays. You can change your fonts, your LED strip. Now this is the LED strip on the back. Matter of fact, let me dim the lights real quick. All right, so I turned the lights all the way off so y'all can get the full effect of these RGB lights. 
First, let's get the full effect of the cooling fan. Look at that. RGB turbo cooling fan. And I don't know if y'all can hear it or not, but you can actually hear the fan spinning. Okay, that's pretty dope. Let's turn that off. All right, so let's go back to the lighting settings. Now you got a bunch of different ones you can choose from. You got flashing, okay? So you can have the light flash like this. You got this one right here. Check that out. Real dope. And of course, you can change whatever color you want. So right now I'll put it on red. You can put it on yellow. Let's do multicolors. Okay, look at that. Real sick. Let's see, you got flow. Okay, have a nice RGB flow. And of course, you got your lamp with sound. Now, the lamp with sound, that's gonna play actual music. And you can have it just steady on. This is pretty dope. Now, for the LED light strip on the back, you can have it for gaming, for media, for notifications, for incoming calls, for outgoing calls, for charging, and alarm clock. So let's throw in the charger real quick, and look at that. I don't know if y'all can see it with the light on, but it's actually green, because my battery is almost fully charged. That is pretty dope. All right, so that's your light settings. You got your phone ring tones, okay? Your message tones, and of course your notification tones. Let's go to lock screen and launcher, nothing to really see there. Let's go to display, okay? 120 hertz for the refresh rate, buttery smooth. You got dark mode, of course, full screen apps, auto rotate, everything on deck. Let's go to sound. Now the speakers on this phone, okay? Super loud. Crazy, <laughs> crazy. Also, the haptics, okay? Let me just change that real quick. The haptics, okay, now you got high definition audio, might as well turn that on. Sound sharpening, turn that on. Okay, there's all your other sounds, everything that you need. Navigation and gestures, nothing to really see there. Okay, you got your Neo AI, okay, for smart game and Neo speed. The cooling fan, okay? Now you can have it start automatically when you plug your phone in, have it start automatically when you start gaming. You can turn the light on and off if you want. Oh, and they got the sounds. Okay, here's the cooling sound, the cooling fan sounds. Dynamic supercar. Mm. Let's see. Cross country speed. And custom sound effects. Okay, that. oh, you can add your own sound effect too. That is pretty dope. Stuff like this I like, let's see. I like this one. Little things like that make me happy. All right, so that's your, cool, that's your cooling fan. You got your digital well-being. Okay, monitor your scumbag activities. Let's go to more features. You got Super Snap. Okay, three-finger screenshots. Your Red Magic uh, water, uh, watermark. Screen recording. Okay, you can change the, uh, <laughs> the direction of the videos. Okay, I like that too. You can hide your floating panel. Screen recording operation feedback. Okay, let's see, uh, screen split, multitasking, free windows, one hand mode, entertainment toolbox, heart rate detection. Now this phone does have a built-in heart rate monitor. Okay, a little bit high right now. Okay, that's right, going down. Oh, going back up. <laughs> okay, let's see. <laughs> All right, 103, that's a little bit fast, but you know, I'm under a lot of pressure right now shooting a live YouTube video with no scripts. All right, so that that, that makes my heart <laughs> beat a little bit faster. In other words, you fat. All right, in other words, you fat. All right, let's see, right, but you do have your heart rate detection. <laughs> okay, let's see anything else. Let's go to uh, passwords and security. Okay, so you got your on-screen fingerprint sensor, face unlock. You do have private space. Let me draw my pattern real quick. Okay, so you can hide all your scumbag photos and videos your passwords, and your files. You got Smart Unlock, use your different devices, yada, yada, yada. Applications, nothing to see there. Privacy, nothing to really see there. Okay, location, nothing to really see there. Battery. 
6,000 milliamp battery. This is a beast, okay, with 65 watt fast charge. Oh, matter of fact, let me see something real quick. Yeah, okay, battery percentage. Yeah, okay, if you want to, you don't have to have the battery percentage. Mine is on 100%. Okay, let's go ahead and leave that on. Advanced settings. Okay, nothing to really see there. Oh, matter of fact, I do want to show y'all one thing. Okay, accessibility. If you're hearing or visually impaired, okay, all of the functions on deck. Okay, exit out of that. System update about phone. This is the big boy right here. Okay, 16 gigs of RAM with 512 gigs of storage. Ridiculous. Okay, and that's pretty much it. Now, one of the things that I always tell people, buying a gaming phone is not necessarily all about gaming. You don't have to be a video game nerd to buy a gaming phone. These phones are perfect for people that like media consumption. Meaning, if you like to watch a lot of videos or listen to music on your phone, there's really three things that you want. You want a big, beautiful display with an under-display front camera, okay? No cutout for the camera in the front. Perfect for watching videos. You want a big, giant battery, 6,000 milliamps. It's going to last you all day long. And you want some crazy speakers. Now, these speakers do have DTSX sound, so they sound unbelievable, okay? So you don't have to be a hardcore gamer to really appreciate this phone. Not to mention, the build quality, the way it feels in the hand, I love it. All right, so now let's check the web browsing speeds. Let's go over to Giztop, one of my favorite online shops. Bang, now this is the full website with all of the pictures. Look at that. Okay. Oh, they got the Red Magic 8 Pro right here from $699, even cheaper. But this is the uh, Xi Jinping version. If you want the global version, you're going to have to spend a little bit more. Let's do a little split screen multitasking. Let's take it over to YouTube on the bottom. Okay, so we can watch some videos and shop at the same time. Now, this is multitasking. You see both screens moving at the same exact time. Buttery smooth. Okay, now you do have your edge panel. So if you want to, you can make your animated GIFs. You got your super snap, screen record, projection, and of course, you can add any app that you want. Now, from this little panel right here, we can open this up as a floating window. Bong, just like that. So say I want to go to YouTube. I can be on YouTube and have Facebook as a floating window. Then if I want to, minimize that. Keep it moving. All right, so now let's test out the dual stereo speakers with the DTSX sound. Now, of course, I got the official Flossy Carter sound test by my homeboy, Mark Rebier. Here we go. Yo, sound test. Tougher sound test. Everybody shut your mouth. Tougher sound test. Extra loud. Look, come up the bottom. Look how loud the top is. You could feel the bass. Ladies and gentlemen, Mark Rabier. That's one of the things that I love about Red Magic phones. They always have amazing speakers, and this one is no different. All right, so now let's take a look at this big, beautiful 6.8-inch AMOLED display with the 120 hertz refresh rate and under the display front-facing camera. So that means all screen. Check this out. Look how beautiful this is. Excellent viewing angles. And again, the shape of this phone makes it so easy to hold in your hands. I love it. This is how you want to watch your videos when you're chilling on your phone. Bezel-less display. Beautiful. 
Let's keep it moving. All right, so now let's take a look at the Red Magic Gaming Suite. Now, when you're ready to start gaming on your phone, all you got to do is hit that switch. And bang, you got a full gaming suite. And it is pretty beastly. Now, it shows all of my different games. Okay, of course, I got the time and my battery percentage. Okay, here's all the different accessories that you could connect. Now, we got all my game achievements. Okay, network settings, screen settings, okay, anti-disturbance settings, system and multi-touch, mirror host mode, okay, all your LED settings, you can change the different wallpapers, turn your watermark on and off, and a whole bunch of other options, okay, so this is all in your game space, okay, now if you want to, you can have game notes, Okay, all your screen records. Okay, your gallery. Now you can adjust your operations, performance. Okay, you got your GPU settings. Okay, your network settings. Okay, everything on deck. Your touch buttons, customize your triggers, everything. <laughs> I love it. Okay, now if you want to, you can have your games displayed in line on panels, you got game space music, and of course, you can turn on your turbo cooling fan. Let's turn the music back off. Now, we'll take it over to Asphalt 9. Let's get busy. All right, here we go. Asphalt 9, my favorite online <laughs> handheld racing game. Let's get busy. How beautiful this looks. I just love this square-shaped phone design. Okay, here we go. I'm on a new level now, y'all. Okay. Okay, yeah, okay. To, to double spin. Yeah, okay. We already, all right, we've been doing that for a minute already. All right, let's go. Now, this is my first time on this board, y'all. I promised y'all I was going to start trying new levels. You know, let's go. Okay, I need that ramp. Need that ramp. What am I doing? All right, let's go. Little drift right there, you know what I mean? Let's go. Oh, this is too much fun. I need to start playing this game more often because it is actually very relaxing. Oh, I rap, I rap. <laughs> okay, hold up. Now. Let me turn this off for a second. As you can hear for yourself, the speakers on this phone are ridiculous, but this is just way too much fun, okay? Again, the build quality makes it a lot easier to hold, but as you've seen for yourself, gaming on your Red Magic 8 Pro, no issues at all. All right, so now let's take a look at the camera. Triple camera set up on the rear, under the display camera on the front. Now watch this. Even though you can't see the camera, if I switch it around, you notice the camera does actually work. So let's go through some of the different shooting modes. So you got camera friendly with a whole bunch of different modes, such as starry trail, multi-exposure, ID photos, time-lapse, document, macro shots, cartoon, panorama, vlogs, monocolor, just too many to choose from. You got pro mode, change your white balance, your shutter speed, your ISO. You got regular photos, so you can do wide angle all the way up to 10 times zoom. Okay, now you got videos that you can go all the way up to 10 times zoom. And of course, you got all the way up to 8K 30 frames per second or 4K 60 frames per second. You got night mode and you got portrait shots. Let's do a quick portrait. Shoes. Shoes looking extra angry right now. Okay, check that out. This is a gaming phone with an excellent camera. Take a look at these test pictures and videos for yourself.
Now let's do the RDA test. Regular daily activities. Now you just spent over 800 bucks on the phone. Let's see how it works in the real world. Now you're gonna have your phone charging up on the table. You got an always on display, so I don't have to pick it up. I can see the time, the date, and my battery percentage. And of course, look at shoes is kind of looks like Batman on my phone. Now when I'm ready to open up the phone, I have on-screen fingerprint sensor, which works flawlessly, or I can just pick it up and look at it, bang, just like that. Now, the first thing I like to do, check my Google feed, okay? Let's see, Steam, some Steam updates, okay? New headphones, UAG cases, okay? The Pixel 7, <laughs> okay, still outside, okay, okay? Henry Cavill, what's going on with him and the latest Superman saga, okay? Shout out to the New York Giants, okay? The New York Giants won the first playoff game, we still alive. Okay, the Crocs, the Yeezy Crocs. <laughs> okay, it is what it is. Your boy uh, Sleepy Joe taking our uh, documents home. <laughs> Bro, come on, man. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I can't call it. Yeah. I can't call it. Anyway, okay, case to five cases. It is what it is. All right, so that's my Google feed. Again, 120 hertz refresh rate. Excellent scrolling speeds. Keep it moving. Next thing we want to do, let's check the weather. Okay, 36 degrees, mostly clear. Tomorrow looks like uh, 45 degrees and sunny. Very beautiful day in New York City. Kind of cold, though. Now, let's do a little bit of work. All right, so I'll go over to uh, Gmail. You see now, I do have all of my Android 13 widgets. All right, so let's go to Gmail real quick. Okay. Costco is hiring. Okay. Let me, let me reply. Costco is hiring. How much? <laughs> how much y'all paying me? How much y'all paying me? That's how that, that's how I fill out job applications. How much y'all paying me? Who want me? Which one of y'all want me? That's how I fill out job applications. All right, so that's my Gmail segment of the day. That's work. But again, all your widgets. Okay, check this out. You got the turbo cooling fan widget. RGB lights. Now listen to this. You got two different speeds. 
Y'all can y'all hear that? I put it right by the mic. You can hear the turbo cooling fan on. I have turbo cooling fan actually on. If I want to, I can project my screen and work right from my phone. But anyway, work segment of the day done. Let's keep it moving. Now we'll take it over to some music. Okay. Bong just like that. Play some music. Rock out. I love the um, YouTube widget also. I had the turntable widget, real nice. Check my calendar. Okay, I got a, I got a meeting with Mint Mobile tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Ryan Reynolds. I got a meeting with Ryan Reynolds tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> see what's going down with that dude. Anyway, you see? <laughs> Excellent. Excellent <laughs> scrolling speeds through your home pages. Fully customizable. Next, all right, so we just finished working. Let's do a little social media. Let's take it over to uh, Facebook. Let's see who RIP this week, because whenever you go to Facebook, it's straight RIP segments. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. And Facebook right here. Nothing really going down. Okay, everybody all smiles. That's what I like. To, let me get it like that. I like to see people smiling, having a good time. I do, you know, my dude got on the air grandpas. All right. He got on the air grandpa. What are those sketches? He got on the sketches. Sketches. Bro, I, I got to comment on this one, yo. <laughs> I got to comment on that one. Bro got on the sketches. That's my guy, though. You know, it is what it is. Okay, we got the G-Shock Tiffany Dow Pateka likes. Oh, my God. G-Shock is doing it big. I, I actually like that. Actually, matter of fact, let me go ahead and take a screenshot of that. Bonk, because I think I might have to come back to that one. All right. So, anyway, so, uh, okay. Now look, 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 look at my man Marv. Look at my man Marv. Look at my man Marv. <laughs> get one, get one jacket, bro. This is why you can't give dudes a couple of dollars, though. They go out and get one jacket, and they be post up like this. Yeah, this is my dude, Marv. Though. Anyway, all right. So uh, we got my man Kev, I right, beer gang on deck. Okay, this is a family show. All right. Anyway, um, so that's it with that. <laughs> family show. All right. So here's how your Facebook is gonna look. Now, if I want to, I can open this up as a split screen. Go to Chrome at the same time. Watch some YouTube videos. Let's see who we got. My man, We The People. Watch some We The People. Or I can go full screen. Or I can exit out of that. Just like that. Now watch this. If I go to YouTube, let's go right to straight video. Let's see, we got, um. Well, let's, pull up, let's pull up something. Okay. Stay in the car. Sorry, my okay. doesn't Off the ground, I was a police okay. department. You know how fast you were just going, ma'am? I'm, so I'm trying sorry. to see if I got my picture in picture on. Okay, I got to turn that on in the settings, but this phone does support picture and picture. I just got to turn it on in the settings. Anyway, so that's how your YouTube video is going to look. Let's do a quick floating window. Okay, back to Facebook. Okay, in the floating window. If I want to, exit right out of that. Bomb, just like that. You already seen the split, uh, split screen multitasking. Let's take it over to Twitter. Okay, now look at this. This is a wild one. This is a wild one. Y'all see the dude? I don't know if y'all seen what happened. Look, watch from the beginning. Let me turn the volume down. All right, hold up. Let's pause it. Keep your eye on this dude right here with the striped shirt. All right, keep your eye on my man's striped shirt. He's having dinner with his girl, okay, and somebody comes to rob them. Keep your eye on striped shirt. Watch this now. That guy's coming to rob the place. He's pulling out a, he's pulling out a, you know, a weapon. Look at striped shirt. He was like, all right, well, it's been a good date, all right, so I got to keep it moving. He just left her for dead like that. I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> in some ways, I want to say city boys up, but in other ways, I don't know. That's, that's pretty cowardly. Anyway, so let's take it over. <laughs> I know. Let's go to mentions. Let's see what's going down. Okay. All right. So somebody got a bunch of new speakers. Okay. Okay. My, okay got a bunch of new speakers. I like that. My man, El Jefe. El Jefe. What's going on, El Jefe? Let's see. We got uh, Dave P. Check these out on YouTube. I will. Okay. Anyway, so here's how it's true. Here's, here's how your here's how your um here's how your Twitter's gonna look. Okay, now I got mine's on the dark theme. But if you want to, on just like that. And again, if I want to, split screen multitasking, Facebook and Twitter at the same damn time. Exit out of both of those. Bong. Next, let's take it over to TikTok. Okay. Let's see what's going down on TikTok. Okay. Oh, look at the Maya. Maya might be outside. Maya going to Disney World. Okay, you know. Okay, now I turn the volume down on this. All right. Okay. Oh, the cops. Now, usually I don't really be rocking with the cops, but however, <laughs> however, 
I'm just kidding. All right, let's see. Um, you got some birthday cakes. Okay. Oh, look at my man. Look at All right. Now, this is not this is not big man activity. Right, this is not big man approved activities, but hey, to each his own. All right. To each his own. This, this dude, he, he living life. I got to give it to him. He living life. I ain't mad. I ain't mad. I ain't mad. Okay. Okay, if you're a homeowner, okay, I'm not trying to get any information from... Okay, this is a family show. All right. So anyway, here's how... Oh, yeah, that's all, what's, what's up with the big dudes dancing? What's going on here? What's going on? Anyway, so here's how your TikTok is going to look again. See, now, in this angle, you can kind of see the under-display camera. But when you're watching videos, you're not going to see anything. But the screen, this is a family show. I'll, make, I'll look for y'all. Yeah, y'all ain't want to see that. <laughs> y'all ain't want to see that. This is a family chat. Anyway, okay. This is TikTok. Let's exit out of here. It's a little spicy right now. Now let's take it over to Instagram and see what's going down on the Grizzam. Okay, now this is what I like to see. Ice. Y'all know I'm all about that ice life. So I like to see. Well, if iced out APs, you only live once. Might as well enjoy it. Okay, so we got some new rides right here. That's the new Jeep. Actually looks pretty dope, which I think. Let me get to save that because I might have to look at that later. Okay, now not only big dudes dancing, we got the big chicks dancing too. Oh, it is what it is. Okay, okay, okay. What is this now? <laughs> what is this? Got the big, somebody got Big Bertha home? Okay, let me get it like that. Uh, sneakers and burners? Okay, hey, do your thing. All right, shout out to my man Neves Knives. Okay. Now, look at this. Now, I was watching this earlier. My dude right here got some, my, my dude right here be balling, yeah? All right, this dude out here hooping. He hooping for real. Look, 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 look at that. That no look fast like that. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Got cold water alerts. Okay, now this is the Giants game. Shout out to the NYC Giants. Bringing home the dub. Okay, Waka Flocka knows who almost murked him. Okay, he deserved that one. Hey, maybe you did. Okay, this is a family show. Family show. This is a family show. Okay, anyway, so here's how your Instagram is going to look. As you can see, this is not just about gaming. This is about media consumption, and this is what you're going to be doing. You're going to be consuming media. You're going to be on social media looking at stuff like this all day. This is the kind of phone you want, the square phone that's easy to hold in your hand with a big, beautiful display and the big, uh, big sounding speakers. That's what I meant to say, the big, beautiful sounding speakers. Yo, why do look like MLK? <laughs> I was about. I was like, hold on a second, yo. Hold on a second, yo. Look at that, dude. Look like MLK, yo. Wow. Okay, now how come I never open up any packages and find this? This is what I want to bring home from the store when I go shopping, you. Know? All right. Okay, this is a family shop. A family shop. I right, shout out to my man, baby. All right, baby, just hooked me up with a new piece. All right, my man, baby. You know what I'm saying? Let's keep it moving. Anyway, so here's how. This is my here's my Instagram. Let me see. This is my 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 usual shenanigans when I'm out at dinner. You know. My shenanigans. Anyway, RDA, regular daily activities. Let's do one more. I'm going to pull up one more website. Now, the last thing I like to do I, at the end of my day is go over to my website, flossycarter.net, and I like to buy some merch. <laughs> I, like, I like to go to my website and buy some of my merch, and I actually wear it. Okay, now you see like this one right here, the uh, Family Show t-shirt. Watch this. If you look at my last Instagram photo, you see, I'm actually wearing it. I'm wearing the Family Show t-shirt. Okay, and watch this. Check this out. The other night, I had on the black version of the Family Show t-shirt. Make sure y'all head over to flossycarter.net and get your Family Show t-shirt. Anyway, I know, shameless plug. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. Anyway, RDA, regular daily activities. Like I said, this is not just about gaming. This is a really, a really dope phone that anybody could buy. If you want a phone with a big, beautiful display, say you don't take a lot of selfies, okay, because I will say this, the front-facing camera is not the best in the world, but say you don't take a lot of selfies, you don't need that big cutout. All right, how many of y'all actually use the front-facing camera to take selfies anyway? A lot of me, I turn my phone around and take selfies using the uh, rear camera. But if you just want a phone that has a big, beautiful AMOLED display, a 6,000 milliamp battery, okay, RGB lights everywhere, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Pretty good camera, ridiculous speakers, okay? This is it right here. But my main thing that I'm loving about this phone is the build quality. I'm hoping that all phones take a page out of our Red Magic's playbook, headphone jack also, audio files. 
headphone jack. I'm hoping that all companies take a page from Red Magic's playbook and bring the phones out like this. A nice square design. Okay, look at the difference from last year and this year. I think this is a true upgrade. Let's grab the case. Okay, now here's how it looks with the case on the back. Let's do a little wipe down. Okay. Nice little case. Not really too protective, but it's just going to cover the back of your phone. Anyway, one more. <laughs> wipe down. Bang, there it is. This is the Red Magic 8 Pro. On a scale of 1 to 10, I'm giving this one a major, major, major go. I am totally feeling this phone, and if you buy this phone, you're going to be feeling it too. Anyway, hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this one. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google+. Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Boxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time, 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know, Stream Gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys in lap. Oh yeah, special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat. Flossy underscore Carter, that's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad. I see y'all in the comment section early. Hashtag salute. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and picture me rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. Spock wanna be low. buy some of that technology you gotta understand certain things subscribe to Flossy Carter he does reviews of all the latest technology the iPhones the iPads the galaxies the Samsung's whatever the fuck the beats by that doctor guy and he puts his kitty cat in the videos too for you something to look at you know I'm an animal lover so I like that shit so make sure you hit the subscribe button, the Flossy Carter on the YouTube, the follow button on the Insta face, and the like button on the face look. Because if you don't, we're going to have a fucking problem here. A bad one. Now hit the fucking subscribe button.